Hi Taurus, it's Elle here to do your weekly reading. Thank you for being here. Let's get into it. Thank you God for blessing Taurus with a clear, concise message from you. Alright, so let's see what's going on for Taurus this week. Thank you God for blessing Taurus. Alright, let's see what's happening for Taurus. King of Wands can be dealing with the Sagittarius. Sag coming up heavy. Uh, Aries Leo also could be dealing with a male Cancer. Uh, let's see. It looks like you are dynamic, outgoing, charismatic, funny. You look good. If this is you as a male, some of you are extremely sexually active. And this per this person, this type of energy can be sexually active, especially if you're a man. Maybe well into, you know, late into life, you know, um, upwards 60, 70, still sexually active. This is a person who has an idea. They go after the idea. This is a, a a charismatic energy, you know, personality personality that's larger than life. This is somebody here who sees the bigger picture. This is someone who's calcu I don't want to say calculated, but they do know how to delegate here. This is somebody who's driven by their passion, you know, and the success the need to want to succeed. Also, this is competition. You know, they're driven by competition. This is alpha. Uh, they they want to dominate. Let's see what um, is happening here. What's the advice? The three of Cups. This person may want to get together with you, communicate how much they like you, love you. Or they want to tell you, you know, they want to tell you something. They want to communicate uh, their thoughts, their, you know, their emotions. Yeah, maybe they want to have sex with you, Taurus, or this is you. This is going to be someone who has to travel to you or travel for work. This is somebody who could be married or couple also. This is somebody who's standing their ground in terms of what they can offer you. You know, and what they will offer you. This is somebody who has somebody, they travel around for work. Uh, they move around for work. Ten of Cups. Um, they seem happy or they may already have a family. They act like a family man. But they, are at, but they really are in, behind closed doors. They're like super single. How everybody perceives them as the family man, the family woman. This is a man, or this could be, this is definitely a male Taurus. But they, they go after, you know, they have like a third party that they're having sex with. Yep. But they're also a family man who is committed and devoted to the relationship. I think to both. But they're committed and devoted to the third party being the third party. And they're also committed and devoted to the wife or the husband being the wife or the husband. They know how to separate the two. One more card for Taurus. Let's see. Yeah, seven of pentacles. So restriction and maturity. Somebody's frustrated. The third party could be frustrated with how things are going. Yeah. Or where the wife is. The third party is frustrated with this husband figure because she feels like they should be in a relationship, that he should be committed to her. Somebody's frustrated with how things are going. And somebody wants to leave it alone, but they, they are not. See what the angel answers have to say. Somebody feels like, okay, we're like twin flame soulmates. You need to be choosing me. You need to choose this relationship and not the one that you're in because you're faking like you're the family man who's devoted and committed. But really, I have your heart and you know it. Or we have a strong connection and you know it. That's how some person on the outside feels about the relationship. What do we have for Taurus? If you believe, you know, if you believe you can have whatever it is you want, no more cards for Taurus. It's up to you, really. Yeah. Uh, maybe forgiveness. Big happy changes. It's like, I don't know, somebody, you have to be assertive in terms of what you want and what you will tolerate. Um, maybe somebody will change if you put your foot down. Um, if you speak confidently, you know, about what it is you will tolerate. Coffee cup. Yeah, if you meet and converse. 
savoring the moment friendship. Yeah, it's like you have to tell this person how you feel. Maybe they, they're willing to make the change. This is somebody who you have a significant amount of history with. Reminiscing, keepsake, making memories. The Phoenix. Um, new phase, rekindle, renew, growth, change mind. Yeah, maybe you need, to, you need to tell them that you change your mind about what the relationship started off to be. Maybe you want more. Yeah. That's what I have for you to words. If it resonates for you, let me know how it resonates for you down in the comment section. Go over to the website and book your own reading there. Ask a question or two by texting it to the number below. You can also donate to the channel by clicking the buy and the coffee link. Um, come join the channel also. Click that join button and you will be, uh, you'll have access to all the extended readings. And you can ask me a question each and every month. Um, come for the lives. I do live every Tuesday, Thursday, and Sunday night, 9.30 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. Uh, thank you, Taurus. Many blessings to you. Take care.